Hey everybody, we are back doing the Temple 420 Bible Study and Torah Tour. And we're going to be in John today in 4, 20, 4, 2, 0. John 4. But I always like to get that 420 in, right? Alright, here we go at the 22nd mark. You guys ready to talk? <coughs> Listen, hear, absorb, <laughs> and abstain. All right, so we're going to pick it up in John 4. I almost want to say 1 John because I've been reading so many of those letters, but this is just John 4. <coughs> this describes the three different types of food that we eat. This is really important. This is Jesus talks with a Samaritan woman which is summer tan or Sumerian tablets. At that point, Samaritan, summer. Okay, good Samaritan. So this is a good person, but there's some differences. Now Jesus learned that the Pharisees had heard that he was gaining and baptizing more disciples than John. Although in fact, it wasn't Jesus who baptized but his disciples. So he left Judea and went back once more to Galilee. Now we have to look at the baptism because I think it is just by water is the description of the parable that would be by smoke, by the baptism, by the cloud. At that point, John the Baptist comes eating wild oats and or wild honey and locusts, an inference to the same diet of the spirits the bread of the angels. So at that point, now, he, Jesus, had gone through Samaria, hence the Samarian tablets, potentially, summer, Samaria, Samaritan. So he came to a town in Samaria called Sychar, or Sychar, near the plot of ground Jacob had given his son, Joseph. Jacob gave his son, Joseph. Joseph, Jacob, Isaac, Abraham. See the lineages, four just generations right there. Jacob's well was there. Now the whole point about the book is to be well and be cured. At that point, like meat, cooked, and you're clean. Okay, you're ready to eat or the aroma. Jacob's well was there, and Jesus, tired as he was from the journey, sat down by this well. It was about noon. So at this point, he's going to describe how he's tired. That's his feeling. We're all tired. We're tired of the journey. We don't know what we're doing. And he sits down next to this well. Let's see what happens. When a Samaritan woman came to draw water... Jesus said to him, Jesus said to her, Will you give me a drink? His disciples had already gone into the town to buy food. So he's asking for a drink of water. They went in to buy food. At that point, there's the third element, air, that's left. Here's really something interesting, and we'll, we'll pause the tour on this point. Proverbs 6.27 says, can a man draw fire into his lap? And in the Hebrew, can a man draw fire into his bosom? Basically, can a man draw fire? Can a bosom? That's what the word is. Draw fire in, blow out, Baruch Hashem. 